Okay, you guys, it's 2017 and there's like no reason that you guys should not be looking like a million bucks on a budget. And this is today's look. It's my curly faux hawk using my drawstring ponytail. Really quickly, if you haven't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button and sign up for notifications so you'll know every time I upload a video. So I got this drawstring ponytail from my local beauty supply store. It was $11.99. And it's called the Fritures Equal Drawstring Ponytail Natural Fro. And as you can see, it does have hints of like burgundy or like natural red in it. Um, that's the only one they had and it actually looks good. It looks, it looks spunky. It has a little bit of personality. So I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Give me a quick thumbs up if you did and leave a comment below. Let me know which look I should do next. So let's get on to the video. Okay babes, so here is my drawstring ponytail straight out the package. In case you guys don't know what it looks like on the inside, it's basically a hemisphere and it has hair sewn onto this really tiny cap which has stretch, it has combs, and also has a drawstring that you can secure it with. So it's super natural and it is secure. So I'm starting with a high ponytail as always and if you want to know how I do this sleek look on my natural hair, click the video in the upper right hand corner where I'll show you how to do that. So right now I'm basically trying on the drawstring. Since to create the mohawk I can put it in any direction, I just want to find like the cutest way to wear it. So I'm just going to secure that on my little bun with the drawstring and then I can go ahead and create my mohawk. So here is where creativity really counts. Since I didn't cut the hair not even one bit to achieve the fur hawk, I'm going to use only bobby pins to shape it and make it look how I want it to look. So first I pin one side of the loose hair to the other side, kind of just to strengthen the middle of the mohawk and shape it into an actual mohawk. And then the other thing I do, I pin the sides down and secure the curly hair onto my own hair near my scalp. And just a side note you guys, I'm using a hair piece for extra volume here. But if your hair is longer and thicker than mine or you just don't want to add a drawstring ponytail, this works awesomely on real hair that's curly so feel free to experiment and make it your own. And of course, my last step is to keep adding pins so that both sides of my fro hawk match up and I'm satisfied with the way that it looks. Quick question, do you guys like these detailed videos more or do you prefer to watch me do my hair without a voiceover? Let me know by answering the poll right above. And here's the finished product. Let me know what you think. curly fro hawk with a drawstring ponytail this is under 12 bucks so I really hope you do try it 
Definitely check out my latest video, which is how I style my sewing weaves. And I have my playlist listed as well. So thank you guys so much for watching again, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye! Oh, no.